Do you have someone on your Christmas list this year that you have absolutely no idea where you're gonna get them? Well, this video is definitely gonna help you. In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys five gifts people actually want. Hello and welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sean. I'm back for another video. In this video today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys five gifts people actually want. All the gifts are at different price points, different age ranges. It's just designed to give you guys some suggestions and some ideas, recommendations for different things that you can get someone on your list. Whether they're like picky or uh, they have everything or you just have no idea what to get them, hopefully you'll find some inspiration in this video. So first up, one of my favorite things is perfumes. Uh, a lot of women who are big time perfume collectors. If the person on your list loves smell goods and things like that, perfume is a good suggestion. I'm going to give you guys a few of my favorites. My two favorite perfumes, at least for the last maybe year I want to say, they're both by Yves Saint Laurent. The first one right here is Black Opium. Love this scent. Both of these are great date night scents, but this one right here is Bon Paris by Yves Saint Laurent as well. These are my two faves. I definitely recommend this. If somebody is more on the grown and sexy, slightly floral, spicy, seductive side, if, if that's who you're shopping for, these two are a must, okay? And I've heard great things about this next one, and I actually got this for somebody on my list. And this is the Avera Wang uh, Princess Perfume. This is in the 3.4 ounce bottle. This Vera Wang perfume retails on Ulta.com for $70. And I do believe that these two are $90 and above, if I'm not mistaken. So if you want to kind of get the higher price ones, these are great recommendations. But if you want to save some money, but you still want to give perfume as a gift, I definitely recommend Scentbird. Huge thank you to them for sending me over all these scents and also for sponsoring this video. The scent that I chose this time to uh, use is this one right here in this cute little vial. And when you twist it up, all you have to do is just spray it on you. I've already sprayed it, so it smells great in here already. I'm loving this scent. So the scent that I chose this month is Tom Ford Black Orchid, and it smells absolutely amazing. It goes in well with the other suggestions that I gave you guys, more of the grown woman sexy scent. All you have to do is twist the little vial and pull it up, and that's how you'll be able to see and read the label to find out what you got. Loving this scent, but they also sent me a couple of, I guess, their suggestions or based on my previous uh, little scent profile that I took. So I have this one right here in this teal color. And this one is called, it's by Bagari, and it's Mon Jasmine Noir. Loving the little color canisters they have right now, really cute as well. And the last scent that they sent to me is this one right here, and this is a really cute little pale pink color. I love this color. And this one is in the scent uh, Truly Dazzling by Kate Spade, just like my bag back there. All you have to do is uh, take one of their little scent profiles, letting them know what kind of scents you like, floral, fruity, musk, whatever, and they'll either give you suggestions or you can actually choose from over 250 of their designer scents. If you guys wanna find out more about scent Bird, I'll be sure to link them below. So next up is gift option number two, and I'm going to go with candles. Now you don't want her smelling all good, and her house smells like hot dog water, okay? So we want her home to smell good as well, and that's why I'm gonna be recommending a couple of candles. Uh, I love these two right here. Haven't lit them yet, <laughs> but I love the way they smell, so I'm definitely gonna recommend them. You guys have seen this in a previous haul, but this is the Toffee Brittle by Bath & Body Works. Smells absolutely amazing. And this one right here is a Gooey Marshmallow. Uh, these are two great scents that I recommend for you guys. And then I also absolutely love like the smaller ones as well that have the cute little, like little scene on them. Really cute as well. Nice little packaging to make it look nice and festive. So the larger candles retail for $24.50 and the smaller ones retail for $14.50. I never pay full price for their candles. I always wait for promo codes, discount codes, and random flash sales. So I'm sure they'll have a sale before uh, Christmas time, but also save your coins because Bath & Body Works is one of those stores that always has a semi-annual sale that starts, I think, the day after Christmas. So if you're shopping for yourself, wait until after Christmas. So gift option number three is Trendy Gadgets, and I have two right here. You guys have seen me show you guys this one previously. This is the Google Home Hub. It has the screen. It retails for $149. I've seen it as low as $99, but this is a really great uh, idea for a gift. It does a lot of things. You can have your schedule on here. Um, you can play music, movies, all kinds of stuff on here. You can play live TV on here. It does a lot of different things. Uh, but I also got this one on the more affordable end. Like I said, this one's $150 but I got the Echo Dot. This is on Amazon.com right now for $29.99, I wanna say, 
full price is $49.99. I got mine for $24 on a, a, a flash sale. But this is the Echo Dot, the whole Alexa, play everybody who played me, <laughs> that joke that's around. You can use this with like Spotify and Pandora and all of that. This is a much more affordable option. If you have a music lover on your list, this is cool. You know, the kids are always saying, play Baby Shark and stuff like that. So uh, this is a really great, less lesser expensive idea if you're trying to get a cool gadget. If you don't have the 150 for this, pay $29.99 on Amazon.com and get this. I'll link it below if I can find it for you guys. So gift option number four that people actually want is a nice little goodie basket that has a nice theme or something that the person is into. If she's somebody who likes to pamper herself, she'll definitely like this one that I'm going to talk about. So a nice spa night is a really good option for like a new mom, a mom, <laughs> uh, or any woman who wants to pamper herself. Uh, this is something that I would definitely include. This is the Soap and Glory uh, Pink Credibles little kit. It has a bunch of different of their uh, popular products, the body butter, the clean on me, the hand food, the body scrub, all of that. It even has a face mask in it. I would pair this in a goodie basket with a couple of these. These are just some bath bombs that are from Victoria's Secret Pink. These cute little bath bombs, I would add these to that. And I would also add this super duper plush robe right here that I got, nice and soft. You can add slippers to this or whatever you want to do. Make the whole basket as big or as small as you like. So those are the goodies that I would put in a spa themed goodie basket, but you can do a bunch of different themed baskets. You can also do like a, a movie night uh, centered one where you have like uh, little containers like this in here with some microwave popcorn in here, some of the candy. You can put it all up in some cellophane. You can add some movie tickets. You can put a movie gift card inside here. A bunch of different things that you can do. Wrap it all up in a cellophane bag, put a bow on, on it. You, if the person on your list is a huge coffee lover, you could buy some of the pre-packaged uh, Starbucks gift baskets or you can make them on your own and you can just add some of the favorite things from them. I love this one of my favorite things from Starbucks. This is the salted caramel hot chocolate. Love this. Add some packets of this. Uh, add a box of the K-Cups to that. Um, you can add a cute little um, holiday themed mug or something like that to it as well. And you could do your own gift basket. I love the idea of doing a personalized gift basket because once you know what somebody is into, you can design a whole basket around that theme. If they're a makeup lover, you can design a gift basket with a bunch of makeup goodies in it. Like these ColourPop lippies, you can put a bunch of these in there. You can get a bunch of the little kits, like this little elf kit that I got from Target. You can put some makeup brushes in it. My 12 year old, she's gonna love this. I'm gonna design a gift basket for her. She loves scented lip glosses so I got this with a bunch of different like scents on it she's gonna love this this little bad boy was ten dollars at Target but I'm gonna have the gift basket for her with this in it some bath bombs a little kitty face mask and stuff like that because she's starting to get into cute little girly things she's 12 so but that's why I really like that idea but now on to a gift idea number five all right so gift option number five is if you've seen all the gift guides on YouTube and you still don't know what to get you can never go wrong wrong with this. It's the perfect size, it's their favorite color, they'll love it gift cards. You cannot go wrong with gift cards, whether it's restaurant ones. If you don't know what their favorite restaurant is, you can always get a card like this where it has a bunch of different restaurants on there like Olive Garden, Longhorn, places like that. I would definitely recommend something like this and you can make it like $100 or whatever. Children's Place is a really great option to get um, for gift ideas and things like that, gift options, restaurants and things like that. If you don't know what to get them, do a gift card. Max, Sephora, all your favorite stores have gift cards. And some of them, depending on where you find your gift card, if you spend 50, they'll give you like a gift card for $10. Or with the Cheesecake Factory, I bought a $25 uh, gift card for Cheesecake Factory and they gave me two free slices of cheesecake that I can use, two little, um, little coupons or vouchers or whatever I can use after January 1st for two slices of cheesecake. Their cheesecake is $8 or $9 a slice. So that alone made it worth it. But definitely, if you still don't know what to get the person, give them a gift card for their favorite store and let them go crazy with that. All right, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Be sure to thumbs up if you did. Also, let me know in the comment section below which of these items were your absolute favorite or which item would you be happy to receive? I'd love to hear it below in the comment section. Huge thank you to Scentbird for sending me over all these great scents and also for sponsoring this video. I genuinely appreciate it. I'll be sure to link them below so you guys go ahead and check them out. Take advantage of the promo codes and discount codes and all of that. And that's pretty much it. I love you guys. I'll see you all in the next video. Happy holidays. Later divas and dudes. Deuces honey.